This is a public service announcement provided by Malacan Productions. I'm Dory Marie, and for years, a new crime trend has been affecting our communities, both locally and nationally. The crime that is of purse and car theft that has been happening at gasoline stations where women are the main target and victim. We at Malacan Productions are providing this public service announcement to serve as a safety awareness of how to better protect yourself and the things in your car while conducting business at a gasoline station. But before we get started, let's hear a testimonial. One early morning, I was headed to work but needed to stop and get some gas. I remember pulling into the gas station and sitting at the pump. My purse was right beside me in the front passenger seat. Since I was in a rush that morning, I really didn't want to take my entire purse inside. So I grabbed my credit card, I went inside the station to purchase a few items, and I didn't even lock my car doors. I then went back to my car to pump the gas. After pumping the gas, I got back into my car and reached for my purse to put my credit card back into my wallet, only to notice that my wallet and purse weren't there. My entire life was in my purse, including my cell phone. I lost everything, and until this day, none of my items have been recovered. In this particular incident, the woman driver was not at all distracted. However, because she was in such a rush, she failed to secure her vehicle and belongings, allowing the predators who've been watching her since she pulled into the gas station to make a move. Let's watch this next testimonial. One morning, I was driving to work and needed to get gas. While driving, I was talking on the phone to one of my friends. When I arrived at the gas station, I pulled to the pump and continued having my conversation while pumping gas. I really didn't need to go inside because I just needed to get gas. When I finished pumping, I got back into the car, and before I pulled off, I noticed that my purse had been stolen. My purse contained all of my identification, credit cards, my iPad, work phone, pretty much everything I had. I should have been paying attention. In this particular incident, the woman was distracted by having a conversation on her phone and watching the gas pump at the same time. What she didn't notice was the motorist who pulled up alongside of her vehicle and snatched her purse and other belongings without her even noticing. Let's watch this last testimonial. I was scheduled to go out of town, so I stopped at a gasoline station, which had a great market inside because I wanted to grab a sandwich and some snacks for the road. I knew I wouldn't be long, so I pulled up to the front entrance, walked in, and left my car unattended and still running. I wasn't in the store for more than three minutes, and when I came out, my car was gone. Everything, my clothes, my purse, my phone, and computer, which was in the car, was now gone. I know I shouldn't have left my car running. I never thought someone would take off with my car. In this particular incident, a huge mistake was made. We may all feel that it is safe to get out of the car and leave the car running while we run inside of the gas station without any consequences. This is a habit we all need to break. Although the accounts of this public service announcement are fictional, the events that take place happen at gasoline stations every day, and it can be a scary reality, and it's happening much too often. So here are a few safety tips for you to follow when you're at gasoline stations. When pulling into gasoline stations, ensure you are off of your cell phone and alert at all times. Before exiting your vehicle, please secure all of your important items, such as your purses, computers, cell phones, and money, which predators can easily view in your vehicle. Never leave your purses in the front passenger seat of your vehicle when exiting to pump gas or go inside of gasoline station markets. Always take it with you. Once you get out of your vehicle, always look around so that you are aware of your surroundings. When pumping gas, 
Stand at a distance where you can view your entire vehicle. Don't stand directly in front of the pump, watching the price gauge. Do not talk on your cell phone while pumping gas. This is a huge distraction. And lastly, please lock your vehicle doors, even if you're outside of your vehicle pumping gas. Predators at gasoline stations are swift. They don't have much time to break the locks or bust out windows to vehicles. So let's not make their attempts to steal what's not theirs an easy experience. In conclusion, Malacan Productions would like to thank each and every one of you for watching this public service announcement. We hope that we have provided you with additional safety measure tips. If you have any questions or concerns or future ideas for public service announcements to be filmed, please contact us at production at malacanproductionllc.com. Thank you.